All right, Matt, congratulations on, on the hiring of uh, Curtis Atkinson. Tell us a little bit about the process and why did he stand out? Uh, the process was arduous, and uh, as I mentioned in the press conference, I had some trepidation trying to re replace Ken is a, is a big deal. Um, but we went out internationally. Uh, we had over 25 qualified applications from right across the globe, from NCAA schools, U Sports schools, Canadian colleges, sporting associations in Canada and across, uh, across the globe. Uh, what stood out about Curtis uh, was certainly his passion for the sport, the fact that he was a student athlete, uh, and the fact that he spent nine years at the University of Regina uh, in the last almost year and a half of that as the interim director of athletics and recreation. We know Regina to be a great school. We certainly love to beat them. We have infinite respect for them, and he brings a lot of experiences from Regina that we would like to, to use here and build on the foundation that Ken left behind. No pun intended, but does he have big in, big shoes to fill uh, for uh, replacing Ken Olenek? Uh, literally and figuratively. Ken brought us into uh, Canadian yeah. University sport. Uh, he made us competitive. We had some great years under Ken, and uh, he's left a great foundation for, for Curtis to build on. And, and given his experiences at Regina and elsewhere, we, we think we've got the right guy. What are your expectations for the program moving forward now? Um, as Curtis said in the, in the uh, press conference, uh, he likes to win, I like to win. Uh, certainly it's about student development, making sure that we're producing great student athletes uh, that do well in school, that do well in the community, but winning on the court, on the field, uh, on the track is, is, and in the pool is significant for us and we, we want to be players. We want to build on the successes we've had.